practice lessons on dive bombs. You need to get a guitar that's got one of these. It's a Floyd Rose Trem. Or in other words, a floating tremolo. Um, make your job a lot easier. Right, basically, it's all based around harmonics. Uh, I'd advise learning on the G string fifth fret to practice on. Because that's probably the easiest harmonic to pull. Now, there are two ways of doing this. You can do the ways that some guitarists do where they pick the note. And then they do whatever with it. Or you can do the other way where you take your index finger, or any finger in fact, you flick the string, you flick the string, and then you hammer on to the fret. So, for example, now what I'll do is practice that until you got it up to speed so you can go, you know, something like that. And then um, once you've got that, mess around with it. And if you want to, you can move on to harder frets. For example, the third fret I find is quite hard to do. But once you got it, wait. They can sound pretty sweet. Now you've got ones up here as well. But learn the ones lower down the neck first. That's what I would do. Um, you know, you've got harmonics all over the board, so there's a lot of different variations you can do. I would say listen to songs such as Bad Horsey by Steve Vai. I reckon that would help. Right, if you've got any tip, uh, any tips on what I can do, or if you've got questions on what you think you need help on, then go ahead and ask, and I'll get back to you as quick as possible. Don't forget to subscribe. There will be more videos coming. Um, I've discovered iMovie on my Mac, so I can now make more videos, which is pretty fun. So. Yeah, subscribe, comment, rate. Cheers, guys. Take it easy.